Ball has a knack for getting to the national tournament. 2023 marks the program's eighth straight trip to the dance. Brandon Zinner caught up with the Grizzlies, tells us how this team is just that much more special. Butler County softball is back where it belongs. And that's our expectation every year. So, um, yeah, I would say that we were thinking national tournament. Advancing to the junior college championships for an eighth straight year. So much unfinished business after last year, you know, getting to go to the national tournament. As usual, fueled by Wichita area talent. To be a part of that legacy is absolutely amazing. It's just an incredibly special place to be at. Um, I don't think you realize that until you're here. Only this time under a first year head coach. They could have transferred with the new coaching staff. And I think the fact that these kids wanted to be here, um, that just says a lot about the program. Done so with unprecedented dramatics. Earning a sweep of Northeastern in the district championship with Mallory Young coming off the bench, scoring the game winning run on a walk off in game one and hitting an extra inning home run in game two. This was like, this is it. Like, I'm going in and we win or lose right here. So I just need to give everything I got. To see her do that and to see her smile was just an amazing experience. Seeing that actually happen, it just made like my whole heart so happy for her. I mean, everyone was so excited to see that happen. Now set out to finish what they started. You no, know, we might not be like the best Butler team there's ever been, but like our fight and our grit is something unmatched that I haven't seen. In El Dorado, Brandon Zenner, 12 News.